Hello. To make a proper ethanol, good food grade ethanol, first of all we need to process our mesh. Here's the mesh in this container. And here's a continuous steel. Continuous steel processing the mesh continuously into low grade ethanol. It's raw ethanol or crude ethanol that will be processed in a fractional steel after being collected. So our first step is to process this mesh into raw or low grade ethanol. Our second step is to process this ethanol, collect it and process it in a fractional steel. So if someone would like to process a huge quantities, big quantities of uh, mesh and uh, produce big quantities of food grade ethanol or whatever ethanol, uh, the continuous steel is a must thing. You have to have it. So it will save a lot of your time and it can process continuously huge quantities of mesh supplying your fractional steel with raw ethanol that's processed in your fractional steel into food grade ethanol so if you're talking about two three liters of ethanol in one go you don't need this uh, continuous steel if you have five six hundred liters of mesh but don't have six six or seven hundred liters uh, pot steel to process it, you have to have a small continuous steel. So this tiny 8 kilogram machine can replace 5-600 liters capacity pot steel easily. Because it doesn't have to have any kind of boiler that will be loaded, would be loaded with a mesh. All it uh, has is a pump that pumps mesh into the steel continuously so technically you're saving a lot of space and a lot of time um, you actually uh, having your ethanol coming out of this machine in five minutes after you switch it on so it's a rapid distillation uh, and you don't have to wait five six hours uh, as you would wait with uh, five six hundred liters pot steel uh, plus there is no such a dangers like with big pot steels with all those quantities of mesh boiling inside is nothing boiling inside apart from a couple of liters of water in a steam generator this is it all your mesh in your container at room temperature it's supplied into the machine and it processed continuously bit by bit small quantities so anytime you would like to you can switch it off and go away then come back switch it on five minutes you have having your spirit here you can see the percentage of the ethanol so currently we are refining our ethanol, our crude ethanol, uh, through the fractional steel. By the way, this is a new type of fractional steel. It's a new column, new design. It's getting a little bit smaller with application of new materials though the actual diameter of the main column still be the same same production rate same quality and we're getting our ethanol, purified ethanol at So after refining, we will dilute this ethanol with water and make a proper vodka or whatever alcoholic drink and uh, from now on I'm gonna change uh, the design of the column and uh, I'm not gonna produce all type columns 
because old ones uh, were a little bit bulky this one's uh, uh, slightly lighter so it would be easier for people in terms of uh, postage expense because it's cheaper to post lighter things Thank you.